In this video, we'll understand what 1NF is. 1NF is basically first normal form. So there are uh, four major normal forms, 1NF, 2NF, 3NF, PCNF. Uh, in this video, we'll understand what the what 1NF is. Okay, it's very basic, it's very easy, let's understand. So there are four rules for 1NF, for a table to be in 1NF, okay? So these rules are, first rule is single valued attributes basically atomic values basically um, every column okay should have atomic values okay so uh, uh, what it means is basically every cell should have only one one value okay uh, now this table if you see over here it has id name age subject this is not in one and a form uh, why because as you can see this cell is having two values basically id number one uh, this is id one name is pqr age is 18 and um, and id one has opted for two subjects dbms and os so this one cell is having two values it is not having atomic values so this is not in one nf so if uh, if you want to convert this into one nf we will have to insert value something like this okay so the same value will be repeated again and TBMS and OS will be repeated, uh, will be uh, will be written uh, separately like this way. Okay, uh, I know repetition of data uh, is happening over here. This is uh, one is re being repeated two times, but this is the rule for one NF. Uh, in the next uh, next uh, form that is two NF, this will be removed, and in the three NF something better will happen. In BC in, and in BCNF something better will happen. So this is the first major. This is basically the first step to a normalized form. Okay. So these, this, these are the rules, okay? The first one was to have atomic values, okay? And now the second rule is attribute domain should not change. Now what this means is basically the data type of the attributes should not change. Now for example, the um, data type for ID, if the data type for ID is uh, int, so only int value should be over here. A, B, C or something else cannot be entered. This is what rule number two says, okay? Now for example, there was another another attribute over here date of birth uh, whose attribute is also date of birth now if you insert uh, some alphabets or uh, some inter value it will not accept it that is what rule number two says now what is rule number three rule number three says unique name for attributes or columns basically each column should have some unique name okay no two columns can have same name now this is also id and this one also says id so there will be a confusion so uh, basically unique names for every column should exist now rule number four is order doesn't matter it means uh, in any order you can write there is no uh, no certain uh, compulsion that id should be over your id can be your your anywhere so these are the four rules of one nf okay thank you